Hi, this is Todd Jaden. I'm shooting a video today because many visitors who come into my office will ask me about uh, the collection of goods that sits uh, behind me on a regular basis. And, and really what it is, some people call it a museum. It, it is a collection of items uh, that have accumulated over the course of an almost 35 year career for me. Um, and, and really there's a tie to Schneider in every one of the, uh, the items. So I'm just gonna talk about uh, a couple of them that have special meaning to me um, based on how uh, they came to be a part of uh, my shelf of stuff. So I'm, I'm gonna start and, and really there's uh, some things from each of the respective areas of our previous three CEOs. So I'll start with, uh, with Al Schneider. Um, actually, this is a, uh, a brandy snifter from his Hall of Fame induction into the, uh, the Packer Hall of Fame. It happened in 1992, so it was after uh, Al had passed away. Um, but there's a picture of Al on the, uh, the glass with Lynn Dickey um, and Larry McCarran, who were inducted uh, on that same evening. Uh, I actually had the opportunity to, uh, to be there. Um, to hear about uh, the induction ceremony. Al had passed away before I started uh, with Schneider. Being a native of Green Bay, I had the opportunity to meet him before I actually started working here. So that's one of the, uh, the items that uh, I cherish um, on my shelf. The second one I'll talk about is a piece of coal. And, and this is probably the, the most special item that I've uh, acquired. It came from Pat Schneider, Don Schneider's wife, after Don passed away. Um, and Pat uh, shared it with me. She also shared with me um, the origin of the, uh, the piece of coal. It came from one of our drivers. And it was a Christmas present to Don, um, where a driver in the car indicated to Don that uh, he hadn't done a very good job that year and the driver wanted him to know that uh, this piece of coal could be a reminder to him as to uh, making certain that drivers were taken care of. Don kept that piece of coal for many years and, and after he passed away, um, Pat was kind enough to, uh, to give it to me because she knew that I worked with drivers on a daily basis and, and certainly um, this piece of coal has a lot of meaning to me um, for two reasons. One, because it came from the Schneider family and, and second because it does uh, uh, remind me of the importance of the uh, the driver to our organization. Uh, the third memento is a, uh, a token from the New York Stock Exchange. I had an opportunity to participate in that event which uh, certainly was a milestone for the organization back in 2017. So that's uh, an important part of, of my collection. Um, the, the fourth thing that, uh, that I'll talk about is, uh, from a business perspective, a, a very important milestone. This is the initial proposal from IBM back in the 1970s to, uh, to really take our trucking platform and move it into a, a computer-based computer kind of technology. So it's really the, the initial offer between IBM and Schneider to start to, uh, to create a technology platform for the company. So kind of an exciting piece here. And then uh, the last thing that I'll, uh, I'll talk about is um, what I refer to as our history book, The Leap of Faith. So for those of you that have seen me on video before in my office that sits on my table, um, because it is an important uh, artifact for the, the organization. Um, there's not many organizations that have the opportunity to say, you know, we've been around long enough and have such a rich history that a book has been written about us and, and we clearly are one of those organizations. So just uh, in summary, you know, a memento from each of the respective uh, former CEO eras and some things that uh, were very important to me as an associate of the Schneider organization. So that's it. You take care. Have a great day. If you get a chance, you can come up and look at the, uh, the rest of the, uh, the items on my shelf. And uh, there's a story behind all of them. I can tell you the story.